All right, Stuff Seller here. It is Saturday, April 23rd. Went to several garage sales just right here in the neighborhood and uh, picked up some amazing stuff. Got a bunch of concert t-shirts. Got some Padres chargers, uh, vintage stuff. Uh, got some games. Uh, just all kinds of cool stuff. I ended up spending 200, I wrote it down here, $283 on everything. And there is one t-shirt that will probably get all my money back on one t-shirt. As I show them to you, you let me know which one you think it is. I will let you know at the end of the video. But very cool stuff so let's get right to it i'll show you what i got <music> all right at the first garage sale i was one of the first people there and they had a box of concert t-shirts and uh, they wanted ten dollars a shirt i think i ended up paying five dollars a shirt but like I said, I paid $283 for everything, including uh, this Xbox here. But let's go through it. So first up is this. Uh, some of them are vintage. So if it's 20 years older, old or older, it is vintage. This is an anger management with 50 cents M&M. And this is from 2005. So very cool shirt. It's got some artist in the back um let me see where i can put these then we got aerosmith this one is not that old we got bob seeger we got sticks and ariel speedwagon um let me see if that has a year on it 2000 so that is considered vintage since we're in 2022 now check out this Tom Petty. This is, um, I don't know if it's single. No, this is double stitch, but this is a uh, 2002. So this is a concert before he passed away. Very cool shirt, Tom Petty. We got Jethro Tull. Um, let's see when this one was. 1999 that is considered vintage we got a santana shirt here we got kid rock kid rock uh 2002 so that's 20 years old check out this oz fest this is um rob zombie 2002 got a deaf leopard very cool. Let's see what year this is. 2006. Uh, we got like a woman's Aerosmith shirt here. Uh, check this out. This is G Easy. It's pretty recent. 2018. Endless summer tour. Pretty cool. Got another Aerosmith. 2002 I thought this one was pretty cool this is a Rolling Stones from the Super Bowl 2006 Super Bowl 25 I think very cool and then oh here's another Rolling Stones I don't think this one's that old another 2005 and then a kiss so yeah, these are uh, concert shirts and the one I'm wearing that you saw in the beginning was a Black Sabbath Ozfest from two, uh, 1999. So what shirt do you think will pay for everything here? Let me know. And then we got some Padre stuff. Here's a Padre stitch jersey, uh, 125th anniversary. I'm not familiar with this player, Hathaway, but uh, must not been with the Padres too long, or unless that's a custom jersey, I'm not sure. This is a Los Angeles Rams vintage 
made in the USA. Um, single stitch, very cool. And we've got this Chargers 1993 Lightning Strikes. And we'll be back on the back. We got San Diego Padres League Champ 1998. And we got. Who's the Sammy Sosa, Chicago Cubs, home run record. Let's see if this is, uh, this one's made in Mexico. It is double stitched, but it's still very cool. Some vintage hats, we got the Charger hat here. And we got this vintage Padres hat, and this is, uh, Major League Sports Specialties. Thought that was pretty cool. Got some pennants. It's a Tony Gwynn 3000 Hits pennant. And then Padres World Series 1998 pennant. Oh, and then we got this Chalky jersey. New York Giants, brand new with tags. Thought that was pretty cool. Then we're gonna go over here got this Padres jacket, kind of a windbreaker, majestic, pretty cool. And then check out this Charger jacket, Logo 7, is that cool or what? Very vintage-y, got the Charger there, the Logo 7, they had five bucks on it. That's a still. Uh, so then we'll come over here. Um, again, 283 for everything. This is just an old satin jacket, uh, casino jacket. And I got it cause guess what? It's made in the USA. Very cool. And uh, these little pogs, I guess they're called. And these were all Junior Sale, number 55. I thought these were pretty cool. You know, Drew Brees, signed book. Very cool. Just picked up this little wireless. Those go for like 20 bucks, easy. Little Spuds McKinsey Bud Light cup. You got a Pikachu shirt here, Pokemon. And then this box is just full of uh, miscellaneous stuff. There's some pinheads here, Mike Piazza, McGuire, Sosa. Got some cards. This is filled with cards. I haven't gone through it. And these cards here, Padres, here's Joe Montana. I don't know if that's a real signature or stamp. Um, there's a Tony Gwynn. There's a bunch of cool stuff in here. Some more cards. These are unopened cards. Very cool. And then another garage sale. I picked up this big old pumpkin snow globe for five bucks. Not snow globe. Uh, Blow mold for five bucks. Very cool. And then got a calculator here. This is a TI30XA. Not sure on that. Then I got these little Game Boys. They're in rough shape. They don't have the backs. Um, came to me for two bucks each. This one doesn't even have a thing there. So I'm gonna sell them for parts. And then, got these homies. Got this whole bag of homies here for 30 bucks. Bunch of little homies. I don't think they make these anymore, but I thought they were pretty cool. $30 for all of them. And let's go over here. Then I went to this sale and I spent 15 was oh no he, he gave me this xbox for 10 
uh, the controller will get me that. And these games are two dollars each. PlayStation 2. So, not bad there. And then lastly, was Michael Jackson's Thriller on Betamax. Not sure if this has any value, but I just thought it was too cool to pass up. And then a couple of uh, Stephen King kind of like Pulp Fiction type books. I thought those are pretty cool. So yeah, 283. My money will come back on. Oh, including the shirt I had on in the beginning of the video, the Ozfest. But my money will come back and you can look it up on, did you guess it right? Did you guess it right? This anger management shirt. These things were going for easy $200. And uh, you got 50 cents, M&M. Look it up, anger management tour three. Uh, anywhere from 200 to 250 dollars so most of my money back on this shirt this one i did look up i did not find any of this style for that year so this is going to be an unknown but we'll see all right so all this stuff will be appearing in my ebay store if you're interested stuff seller out you all have a great day keep hustling mm -hmm.